The announcement was made by the Institute's Vice Chancellor, Professor Burton Mwamila, during a visit by the Minister for Communication, Science and Technology, Professor Makame Mbarawa. He said construction of the Institute has now reached its final stage after completion of buildings, including hostels for postgraduate students, and that essential laboratory equipment has also started to arrive. The Minister said the Institute, which cost the government more than 38 billion shillings, aimed to provide education of international standard in disciplines of science, technology, and engineering, so to be able to make Africa be competitive in these disciplines.